actress Heather Lindsay North, popularly known as Heather North, died at the age of 71. She is known for lending her voice to the character of Daphne Blake in all incarnations of Hanna-Barbera's children's much-loved cartoon Scooby-Doo for 33 years. Though the actress died November 30th, her death was revealed on December 19th, a week after her 72nd birthday. According to the report in The Hollywood Reporter, North's family friend Jody Mann told the publication that she died at her home in Studio City, Los Angeles, after a prolonged illness. The Days of Our Lives actress's net worth is believed to be more than $6.1 million, according to the report in Net Worth Room. North had voiced the character of Daphne from September 1970 to 1986, then in 1997, and for a short time in 2003. North became the second actress to voice Daphne's character. Before her, India Estefaniana Christopherson voiced the character during the first season of Scooby-Doo, Where Are You?, in 1969. According to the Inquisitor, North, in an interview, said she agreed to audition for the role of Daphne after her roommate Nicole Jaff David convinced her that her voice would be perfect for the role. Nicole voiced the role of Daphne's pal Velma Dinkley on the Scooby-Doo cartoon series. North was born on December 13, 1945, in Pasadena, California. In 1971, she married the Emmy Award-winning producer-director H. Wesley Kenny who was famous as Kenny. The couple met on the sets of the movie Days of Our Lives. Kenny died due to cardiac arrest in January 2015 in Santa Monica, California. He was 89. North played the role of Sandy Horton for a few years on the NBC daytime serial, Days of Our Lives. According to the Net Worth Post, Kenny had an estimated net worth of $9 million. North is survived by her son Kevin, daughter-in-law Stephanie, stepdaughter Nina and her husband Brent, stepsons and his wife Leslie, and granddaughter Jocelyn. According to a report in The Hollywood Reporter, North had one more stepdaughter, Cara, who died just a week ago. In 1971,